Isn't it crazy how life can just hit you by surprise? And the Bible does say rain falls on the just as well as the unjust. It means that we all go through stuff. We all go through different things, trials, uh, things that we weren't prepared for. And I think it can be really frustrating when, um, when we're challenged like that. You make your plans. You know where you want to go. You know what you want to do. And then suddenly you're just not on your back trying to figure out, okay, what do I do now with this negative surprise, this negative situation? What do I do? There's only a couple choices you can make. Either you can choose to be defeated. You can choose to let the weight of this negative surprise crush you or you can choose to react as positive as you can. And it's not easy to choose to be positive when something negative happens. You know, something negative affects your finances or your body or something negative affects um, someone you know or you get stabbed in the back or somebody did something so bad you don't want to forgive them. It's hard to try to find a positive side to that. But when you make the decision to be positive, even though something else happened that wasn't good, it actually makes you stronger. It grows your character. It makes you a better person. It makes you more mature. It's not easy to make that good decision in the midst of bad, but if you want to be a more mature person and you want to do greater things in this life, then you're going to have to make that decision to choose positivity even when you know you just want to be mad and you want to be angry and you want to be frustrated. I've been there before. Something happened and I'm like, oh my gosh. You just want to look at heaven and just go, God, you're going to let this happen, really? I'm trying to get on my feet and then I'm just swept under again. I'm trying to just get my life in order and then this, oh, just knock, this thing just knocks me out of place. But what I do now is I just, just go, Lord, you didn't cause this to happen, but I thank you. Because if he allowed it to happen, then he knows that he put the strength and the ability and he put the confidence, he put confidence in me. He knows, hey son, I know you can make it through this. I'm gonna let it happen because I know you can make it. And I know that this is gonna make you stronger. This is gonna make you better. I don't want my children to just be blown by any little challenge that comes, or even strong challenge. I don't want them just to be blown away. I want them to be strong, like a strong tree that you see outside. That tree is rooted. It can handle anything. No matter what season it is, fall, winter, the worst storm in the winter, that tree is still standing after all of that. And God wants his children to stand, even when things are difficult. So just choose to be positive. Choose to be thankful. Lord, thank you for all the good things that are happening. Because even when the bad comes, there's still something good you can thank God for. Just thank God, be positive, choose to be positive, and just continue to move forward in your life. Nothing is stopping you from moving forward. You can be slowed down a little bit. That doesn't mean you haven't stopped progress. Maybe moving a little bit slower, but that's okay. God needs to spend some time and grow us before he takes us to that next level. So it's going to be all right. And uh, I'm proud of you. I know you're going to be all right. God bless. Have a wonderful day. If you like our videos, you can follow Purpose Destiny at Facebook, Instagram, or YouTube. And you can always visit our website, www.purposedestiny.net. Be blessed.